Well, get ready for this. Internet providers are bracing for a potential disaster tomorrow night. At 11.59.59, an extra second known as leap second will take place, and it could cause websites and servers to go down. Joel Nichols joins us now live from the newsroom with a closer look. What's going to happen, Joel? Is it wrong of me to be happy I'm going to get another second of sleep? Because all of this... <laughs> Stuff could happen, and they only give you six months warning, apparently, and our favorite tech expert, Burton Kelso, is here. Uh, so they add this second so that they, all the computers are in sync with the rotation of the Earth That's right. and get this all together. What potentially could happen when this happens? Well, the problem is, is computers can't handle that extra second. So uh, anything, anything from, from website, website shutting, shutting down to an actual computer or technology device could shut down. Um, so people aren't really sure what could happen, but... Uh, the results could be catastrophic. All right, so if we want to prevent any kind of catastrophic stuff in our own little web world, what should we do to make sure this doesn't affect us? Well, always with all technology devices, you want to back up just in case something major happens with the uh, leap second. Right. Uh, second, um, if you've got uh, Windows or Mac, you want to make sure it's got the latest updates. Um, if you want to avoid the leap second, just turn off your device and turn it back on after it's over. And finally, uh, most of the big manufacturers probably have it covered as far as uh, the leap second. But if you've got older devices, uh, it may be time to upgrade if it doesn't come on after the leap second occurs. So it's quite possible July 1st you'll get up in the morning and some of your stuff may not work anymore. That's quite possible, Joel. Wow. So I don't need to get dry goods in my basement or anything. This isn't Y2K. No, no, it, it's not that major. But, I mean, some things could occur. So you just need to be prepared and uh, hope for the best. Right. And you know for sure that airlines and hospitals and places like that are really going to be prepared and try to be as prepared as they can because they really rely on all of this. So we're ready. Make sure you're ready. As an older device myself, I'm a little nervous. Back to you. <laughs>